There's a little known Disney treasure hidden away here in Los Angeles' Griffith Park. It's a little red barn that played a great big part in Walt Disney's lifelong passion, trains. In 1949, Walt and his wife Lily moved their family to a new home on Carrollwood Drive in the Holmby Hills. Walt used the opportunity to try his hand at a little backyard railroading. He called his railroad the Carrollwood Pacific. The project quickly grew to almost a half mile in length and included a 46-foot bridge and a 90-foot tunnel dug beneath Lily's prize flower patch. The layout was controlled from this barn, which also gave Walt a place to do a little daydreaming. On weekends, Walt loved to take his daughters and guests on trips around the yard. He loved it so much, he decided to expand on it a little. Today at Disneyland and Disney theme parks around the world, guests share in Walt's passion for trains every time they climb aboard and take a trip around the Magic Kingdom. Here in Griffith Park, the Carrollwood Pacific Railroad Historical Society has preserved Walt's barn and legacy, along with the generous support of the Walt Disney Family Foundation, so that generations of dreamers can come and visit and be inspired. As a teenager, Walt Disney's passion for trains led him to a summer job on the Atchison, Topeka, and Santa Fe Railway. The job was modest, selling newspaper and candies to weary travelers. But it gave him a chance to get out and see the country. And for a boy from Missouri, it was a dream job. If you follow your passions, there's no telling where your dreams might lead. I'm Amy Kate Connolly, and I'm running for Disney's Chief Magic Official. That's my dream job. What's yours?